Here I am going to explain aldol condensation reaction of acetone. Acetone is a carbonyl compound. It contains alpha hydrogen. So in presence of L, OH minus, it undergoes aldol condensation reaction. Here we can use sodium hydroxide, potassium hydroxide. So this is alpha hydrogen which is acidic in nature due to presence of carbonyl carbon. OH minus abstract this proton and we get the nucleophile. Here nucleophilic center is carbon. Now this CH2 minus attack to the electrophilic carbon. This is the carbonyl carbon. So this is another acetone molecule. CH2 minus attacks to the electrophilic carbonyl carbon. Now here you can see this CH2 minus and carbonyl carbon making a new bond. So this is a new carbon carbon bond is forming due to aldol condensation. This part is coming from the nucleophile CH3 C double bond O CH2. Now this carbon and electrophilic carbon is making a new bond. This is the another acetone molecule CO minus CH3 CH3. Now this O minus abstract one proton from water molecule and we are getting beta hydroxy ketone. This is carbonyl compound so this is alpha beta so beta hydroxy ketone this is called aldol product. But reaction does not stop in the aldol product here elimination reaction takes place means OH minus and hydrogen the next carbon not from this methyl because this hydrogen is acidic due to presence of carbonyl carbon. This hydrogen leaving as a H plus O is leaving as a OH minus it leaves as a water molecule like a condensation reaction is happening and we are getting a double bond here. So this is alpha and beta to so alpha beta there is a double bond so it's called alpha beta unsaturated ketone. This is the aldol condensation product.